Did you know that we consume more than 400 liquid calories almost every single day, and most of those calories are void of any nutrients, and obviously that can add up to a lot of weight gain? Well, my friend David Zinzenko is here to show us how smoothies can be savory and also good for your belly. Now, you have a new book out called the Zero Belly Smoothies. Yeah, it's, and this to me is like one of the greatest weight loss secrets ever smoothies because it's like 60 second nutrition. It's instant weight loss at the push of a button. And we had 900 panelists who went through this Zero Belly Smoothies plan before we launched and they were losing up to 20 pounds in under six weeks. So they're, they're basically flattening their belly, they're boosting their metabolism, they're healing their digestive tract and they're looking and feeling and living better than ever. Now, Dave, I always say I prefer smoothies to juice because smoothies contain all that wonderful fiber and you're not getting rid of any of the good parts of the fruits or veggies. One of your keys here is keeping those calories in your smoothies at an acceptable level, ideally under 300 calories or so. And this, exactly. this first one is called the Fall Harvest, Harvest Smoothie. Right. This is very reminiscent of your you know, childhood Thanksgivings. Um, and what's really great about this, try it, that's great. Cheers. Honestly, well, that's really good. What this cheers. has, cheers, it has um, sweet potato, mm -hmm. which is a clean source of uh, very clean carb. And what's great about that is it doesn't, it has a low glycemic index, so it's not spiking your, your, Love your blood sweet sugar. Potatoes, absolutely. Then it has nutmeg, which is great for skin health and protecting you from sun damage, so it keeps your skin young. And it's a great natural spice sweetener. It's, it's just like, it gives it a nice, a nice little, little kick. kick. And, then, and then it's also the base, and it's all about the base, is green tea, which is zero calories, and it, it has an active ingredient that helps to boost your metabolism. I wanna move on because Turmeric's all the rage as an anti-inflammatory. What a wonderful spice. We tend to think of it in curry and Indian yeah. dishes, but you have a smoothie called the Turmeric Dream? Yes, sir. <laughs> yes, sir. Also under 300 Clever. calories. Well, thank you, thank you. What, what's great is that um, it's one of the, turmeric is one of the, like, best anti-inflammatory foods on the planet. And, and it mixes excellent. really well with tropical fruit. So what we're doing here is we are using a, an almond milk base, which has 50% more calcium than dairy. It's only 30 calories a cup. And then the pineapple is also great for post-workout muscle recovery. Um, so the, it's a really nice um, smoothie. Well, and I actually will say to folks out there who haven't tried turmeric as a spice, the idea of mixing it with something like a tropical fruit, because turmeric on its own can be, it has quite a kick, so it sure. softens it. I, I, I like the turmeric dream. I'm a fan. All right. But I'm always a fan when I look at a smoothie and it looks like a chocolate shake. So toss yeah. me that, buddy. <laughs> try, to, try to guess Hot what's in there. Hot chocolate smoothie. Mm -hmm. Right? Kind of tastes like pudding. With a Which nice is, little. Oh, whoa. Right? Whoa. Right? <laughs> Come to me, red pepper cayenne. Yeah. Woo! Yeah, baby. Yeah. Out so, of nowhere. Also under 300 calories, nutty, chocolatey, and then it has that kick at the end. So that's the, that's the hot part of this. The cayenne pepper helps to boost your metabolism and give it that awesome kick. I mean, kick. This, it does. It tastes like chocolate pudding with a, a really nice, spicy, hot finish. It's called the Hot Chocolate Smoothie. Um, his book is called Zero Belly Smoothies. And I'll tell you what. You all should be excited because Dave brought a copy for everyone here in the audience. Much more to come.